Jing Jing, here's today those people come to make a commercial yes. for the hotel? Yes, she be it's today. Woo! I hope they put me in it. I want to be on TV. <laughs> well, I'll see what I can do. Yeah, it's about time we had a commercial. I don't like that nasty motel commercial. It's on TV all the time. We should have a better one. Eh? Hi, I'm Mud Claudette for the Nasty Motel. With all the new stuff out there, why not try the junk stuff, like the Nasty Motel, with dirty rooms, empty pools, and rude desk clerks. So if you want clean rooms and value prices, don't stay here. For the Nasty Motel, I'm Mud Claudette. We'll burn the light out for you. Yes. <coughs> I know we need to even let more people know that we are the best and cleanest hotel. And the friendliest. That's right. And Christian run hotel. <laughs> so, whenever they get here, let me know, okay? I'll do that, CC. Yes. Me. <laughs> <laughs> oh, hello, Cece. Oh, I'm going to play Imagination. <laughs> yes. Well, don't be loud or messy today. <laughs> oh, Cece. <laughs> loud or messy. I'm never like that. Never. Never. <laughs> if you say so. is like something we Christians should always do. Tell others about Jesus. Because you know with the commercial we're gonna tell other people about the good things that the hotel does and that will help draw them to our hotel. Well we as Christians when we tell them about Jesus it'll attract them to Jesus as well. You know this reminds me of a Bible story. Peter followed Jesus into the courtyard of the high priest. He sat with the guards at the fire. A servant girl saw Peter there in the firelight. She looked closely at him and said, You were with Jesus! But he denied it. I don't know him, he said. A little later, someone else saw Peter and said, This fellow was with Jesus. Again, Peter denied it. After a little while, those standing near said to Peter, Surely you are one of the disciples? Peter replied, I don't know what you're talking about. Just as he was speaking, the rooster crowed. Jesus turned and looked straight at Peter. Then Peter remembered the words Jesus had spoken. Before the rooster crows twice, you will disown me three times. And Peter broke down and wept. <laughs> got to imagine something that will show the commercial people that I should be in the hotel commercial. Now what could I imagine? Mm. Oh, come in! Hello, Pumpa. What you doing? Oh, I'm trying to imagine something that will make me shine brightly to the commercial people. They've got to notice me. Well, have you thought of anything? Not yet, 
My imagination's not working very good today. I know. Let's pray that God will clear your mind and help you with some ideas. <clears throat> That's a great. Let's pray. Thank you, God. I've got an idea. Oh, you do? What is it? What is it? Oh, your imagination camp. Oh, yeah. I forgot about that. Oh, I'll go get it. <laughs> see, see, the commercial people are here. Just calm down, sheepy. You'll be okay. Oh, well, welcome to the Kidsville Hotel. Oh, you must be Cece. Yes. Um, if you'll go outside and get pictures of the friend building and the lobby. Now, Cece, tell me what you'd like in the commercial. Well, first and foremost, I'd like everyone to know that we're a Christian company and that if you stay here, we want you to feel the love and compassion that Jesus would show and give you the rest like he would do. And la da 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 Oh, I found it! I found it! <laughs> now, Johnny, plug it into that Bible! <laughs> okay, here we go. Mm, there it is. <laughs> All right. Now, here we go! One, two, three! What was that? I don't know, but I think I have an idea. Hello, I'm Sheepy the Bellhop, and I operate the elevator and other things around the hotel. Oh, and the most important part, I can sing and dance. Oh, wow, Pumpa. Your imagination worked. That should let him notice you for sure. <laughs> Hi, my name is Kurt, and I have paper clips. And I'm Bernie, and I have a rubber duck. <laughs> Wait, we can also sing and dance. Oh, and we have the friendliest tenants here. Do you host events at different times? Yes, we have picnics in the park, we have Christmas parties, and we have entertainment in the cafeteria. While our tenants eat, Spot sings a song. Like now. Father, I go walking in the world. The things I say, the world thinks absurd Confessing the best is mine, is my routine Schooling the man inside, the brand new me I'm peculiar, and getting more peculiar Walking around talking prosperity Living in health with my spirit free Peculiar And getting more peculiar And when society doesn't agree That's a good indication to me Religious folk Sometimes they get upset Hearing that we have what we confess 
green with envy, watching me succeed. Watching my God supply my every need. I'm peculiar and get more peculiar. Walking around talking prosperity, living in health with my spirit free. Peculiar and get more peculiar. And when society doesn't agree, that's a good indication to me. Though we're in it, we're not of this world. The light has come, and the word unveiled. No. Natural thinking can agree. Peculiar are the ways of God's new breed. We're peculiar and get more peculiar. Walking around talking prosperity, living in health with our spirits free. Get more peculiar, and when society doesn't agree, that's a good indication to me. And when society doesn't agree, that's a good indication to me. Just give me a call. Okay, thank you. You're commercially ready in about a week. Thank you. Bye. <laughs> Where's those commercial people? Who Where are they? They're glowing <laughs> in your breath. What did you do? I used my imagination. Oh, boy, I need some shades. Uh, what, did I miss them? What are they? No, no, no. They're outside. <laughs> couldn't use any of the film that the camera guy used when he was here? Well, why? The citizens messed up in the shots? Ugh, I'm so sorry. They were a little excited. Yes, they are the friendliest. Oh, did you... You came already and shot some more? Oh, okay. Well, great. Yeah, we'll definitely watch. Thank you. Bye-bye. That was the director. I guess they had to come back and do some shots without the citizens. See, when we push Jesus on someone, it might push them away. But be kind, loving, and joyful, and you'll be able to win them over. You know, I think it's time to watch that commercial. The Kidsville Hotel is the place to stay. But don't just take our word for it. Don't play games. Whenever you're in Kidsville, stay at the Kidsville Hotel. You'll always be a winner, just like me. 
When we stay in Kidsville, we only stay at one place, and that's the Kidsville Hotel, because you have all kinds of fun there. The rates are so low, it's like you're stealing. When I'm away from the ranch, there's only one place I stay, and that's the Kidsville Hotel. They got the best prices and value this side of the Pecos. See you there. The Kidsville Hotel. Feel so godly, you'll think you're in heaven. That was a good commercial. And you know, kids, don't ever be afraid to tell others that you're a Christian. Just show them. Well, thanks for coming to the Kidsville Hotel. Bye. <laughs>